Daily Mass Readings and Reflection September 1, 2023 Feast Day of St. Giles First reading is taken from the book of 1 Thessalonians chapter 4 verses 1 to 8 Brothers and sisters, we earnestly ask and exhort you in the Lord Jesus that as you received from us how you should conduct yourselves to please God and as you are conducting yourselves you do so even more. For you know what instructions we gave you through the Lord Jesus. This is the will of God, your holiness, that you refrain from immorality, that each of you know how to acquire a wife for himself in holiness and honor. Not in lustful passions as do the Gentiles who do not know God, not to take advantage of or exploit a brother or sister in this matter. For the Lord is an avenger in all these things, as we told you before and solemnly affirm. For God did not call us to impurity but to holiness. Therefore, whoever disregards this, disregards not a human being but God, who also gives his Holy Spirit to you. Responsorial Psalm Rejoice in the Lord, you just. A reading from our Holy Gospel according to Saint. Matthew chapter 25 verses 1 to 13 Jesus told his disciples this parable the kingdom of heaven will be like ten virgins who took their lamps and went out to meet the bridegroom five of them were foolish and five were wise the foolish ones when taking their lamps brought no oil with them but the wise brought flasks of oil with their lamps. Since the bridegroom was long delayed, they all became drowsy and fell asleep. At midnight, there was a cry, Behold, the bridegroom! Come out to meet him. Then all those virgins got up and trimmed their lamps. The foolish ones said to the wise, Give us some of your oil, for our lamps are going out. But the wise ones replied, No, for there may not be enough for us and you go instead to the merchants and buy some for yourselves. While they weren't off to buy it, the bridegroom came and those who were ready went into the wedding feast with him. Then the door was locked. Afterwards the other virgins came and said, Lord, Lord, open the door for us. But he said in reply, Amen, I say to you, I do not know you. Therefore, stay awake, for you know neither the day nor the hour. Reflection from our Holy Gospel I do not know you. It is hurting to hear such words from a friend or a teacher to whom you want to get close. Yet, these are the words of the bridegroom to the foolish virgins, bridesmaids, who are assigned to welcome him but fail to prepare sufficient oil for the night. They did not give allowance for the delay. Jesus tells the parable of the ten virgins to his disciples to teach them what the kingdom of heaven is all about. In God's kingdom, there are two kinds of disciples who want to enter it to join their master, namely, the wise and the foolish. Jesus warns his disciples to be prepared always for his coming. They cannot be half prepared like the foolish virgins. They must be fully ready to welcome him no matter how long it takes. Otherwise, 
Jesus will also reject them at the end of time, no matter how much they knock at the door. Jesus recognizes, as his disciples, only those who behave like the wise virgins. He entitles them to be in his company in his kingdom.